Hello everybody, Mr. Diggs here. Um, I'm just currently, I wouldn't say even halfway through the sort of office sort of refit sort of makeover. And you know when you've done one of those jobs that you think you're going to enjoy and um, sort of take your time on? Well, to be honest with you, it's a case of why did I start this? Because this is taking a lot longer than I expected it would. Um, I'm currently like sort of sat on the floor in my little new DVD room. Um, wondering to myself, why did I start this? Because it's one of those jobs that on paper it looked easy. In practice, it's bloody hard. Because basically, in order to make space, you need space to work in and sort all your stuff out and that's one of the reasons why it's taken a lot longer because I'm having to walk over boxes and bags and stuff like that and currently let me just get up and currently there's lots still needs to be done I currently have um, all the VHS in place with a little bit of room um, there's the VHS the DVDs are all getting there still a lot to uh, put on uh, literally all over the place uh, outside as well getting getting rid of all the pre-owned ones all the all the ones that have been watched and been used and whatever from the charity shops and solely all dealing in brand new seal stuff uh, like blu-rays and kids dvds and stuff like that but yeah it's a nightmare if i can just sort of try and take you to my through my to my room um, and show you the absolute mess I'm in. Um, it's still a lot worse than it was. A lot, lot worse than it was before. Now, I have managed to achieve a couple of things, basically. And that was move one of the rackings there and put it into the uh, DVD room. Uh, this is going to enable me to, all the long boxes that I've got here for clothing, enable them to turn them round so they're actually against the wall, but long, long ways. Um, I still have all those DVDs there, all sealed, and all the stuff behind the clothing and stuff like that. Um, and a lot of, still a lot of pre-owned stuff as well that's going to be taken to a charity shop at some point um i started this at nine o'clock this morning i think it was and it's now uh 20 past five and i'm still going um so if you're going to do something like this you're going to need space you're going to need plenty of enthusiasm which i'm slowly running out of even if i get the dvd room sorted today um and stop put back in here um it's going to be a big step to doing what i need needs to be done and then comes the task of moving quite a lot of this stuff out into the shed um on a plus note, I have had a visitor today and um, I've sold, while I've been sorting my room out, sold quite a bit of um, ceramics and um, cups and stuff like that for, for a few quid. So that was a bit of a bit of an added bonus. But um, yeah, as you can quite clearly see, still a lot of work to be done. Uh, this is probably going to take me the rest of the weekend on and off. Um, obviously, I'm going to need a bit of a rest at some point. Obviously, go to bed. So, um, but 
it's a means to an end, you know. Sometimes you have to go through hell to get to heaven, and that's where I want to get, uh, basically. So, um, for now, this is part two. Part three, and maybe part four, who knows, this probably could turn into an epic, to be honest with you. Um, but yeah, this is a very tired, very uh, amused and drained Mr Diggs. Signing out for now. So, tune in for part three, whenever that may be. Hopefully by then there might be a little bit more organisation. And a lot of crap and rubbish might have been got rid of. But yeah, getting there. Cheers for now.